we all know the saying, an apple a day keeps the doctor away. And what better idiom to remember as the Independence Calendar marks today, Wellness Day. Wes Calix Forbes had the opportunity to attend a health fair. She tells us more in this next report. For National Day of Wellness, the Ministry of Health and Wellness provided free health screening, eye exam, foot assessment, NHI registration, immunization, and many, many more. Minister of Health and Wellness Honorable Dr. Darville reiterated the critical message that wellness should be important to all residents. So we did a study with the Pan American Health Organization along with our governments, and we realized that we are not in good physical condition. We suffer from the largest or the highest incidence of obesity, uh, diabetes, hypertension, cardiovascular disease, and we have a massive uh, amount of individuals now experiencing end-stage renal disease and are on our hemodialysis program. And this is where the push from the public health expert comes in. The equation of wellness, nutrition, and physical exercise. He then went on to sharing some minor lifestyle changes that can be made for a greater impact on one's health. You know, if you're diabetic and you spend 10 minutes of just physical activity, you don't have to be high impact. It can actually reduce the need for, for a large amount of diabetic medications. Do you know if you're hypertensive and you cut down on your salt diet, you may not even have to take medications. According to the acting director of public health, Dr. Philip Swan, the approach for promoting a better and healthier Bahamas will be presented differently this time around. The minister reminds the public that their health should be their first priority. For the Bahamas Tonight, I'm Wes Calix Forbes. Hello everyone, I'm Fern Carey. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things said and asked.